I know some of them, but I'm not super detailed with, with chords. I'm more of just muscle memory and, and um, by ear. Habang buhay, sige. So habang buhay. So yung habang buhay, ganito lang tuloy, madali lang. So, normally kasi pag, pag pinaperform ko ng live yung habang buhay, I perform it ng mas, ma, mas mataas. Kasi nabababaan ako sa falsetto na ginawa ko for the original. So, pag pag strip down and everything, chill lang, okay lang. Pero kasi pag, pag live and everyone's hype, tumatalo na ako, nag, nagsasolo ako, nahihirapan ako, so mas gusto ko mas mataas yung song. So I, I play it on the 6th fret. That's that's the key. But for, for now, let's go with the original. So basically, this is a D. This is, I think this is a D major, D major 7. Yeah. But the key is, you remove the pinky. So, this is a D major 7. Correct me if I'm wrong, but yeah, I think I know this is a D major 7. So, 5th fret. You bar the whole thing, okay? Wow, guitar tutorial. <laughs> Parang ako yung mga pinapanood ko sa YouTube nung bata ako. And then, sa... Ang hirap magturo pa ng ganito, no? 5th fret, 6th fret sa G string with your, uh, your bad finger. <laughs> and your ring finger sa 7th fret sa D string. So, yun yung pinaka-shape na ganito. Normally, I strum it down in pattern ko. It's basically freestyle and just feeling the song itself. So D major 7 and then you go for uh, a C sharp minor. This is the key to my songs. So, all of my songs, not, I mean, not all, or most of my songs, that's kind of like my signature. I always put seven. So, this is a D major seven. And then I go with, instead of going for a, a normal C sharp minor, I go for a C sharp minor seven. So. And it's a C sharp minor seven. Middle finger po kasi yan, hindi bad finger. <laughs> bad finger na lang, mas madali. Ito, baka dumating na yung pagkain mo. Quick break, guys. Hala, dito na si Kuya Grab. Teka lang. Baka na si Kuya Grab. Paano ako nag-order ako wala akong pera? Delibre niyo ba ako? Awit. Isang malaking awit. Wait lang po.